Hey, what's up guys, so you know what's best here. I'm pretty excited about this one because I'm able to show you the new Bose frames. These are the first pair of audio sunglasses coming from Bose and Bose did sponsor this video for me to check these out and show you what they're talking about with these. So anyway, right now I'm gonna be showing you the unboxing as I get inside of this box. I'm welcome with a very nice carrying case for these sunglasses. It feels very premium on the outside and also on the inside, it's very soft and luxurious. I don't think I've ever used that example or phrase before, but um, yeah, it feels really nice inside of it. But yeah, this hard case does do a good job at protecting these sunglasses. And also inside of the box, you will find the magnetic charging cable. And I love how they actually have a gold finish on this. It does again, add to that premium feel of this entire package. And so the sunglasses themselves on the right-hand side of the frames, you will find where you just attach this magnetic cable, it latches on on pretty securely and firmly and then now you just plug it in and you'll be able to charge these glasses and they say these glasses do have a rated battery life of about three and a half hours of streaming and it should only take up to two hours to get a full charge for these but now just focusing on the design of these sunglasses I think it's great that they do have two different designs they have the Rondo design which is going to be more rounded and then also they have the auto design which I'm showing you today which is going to be more squared and both of these designs do come in two different sizes you have small and large and yes you can guess by the size of my head I had to go with the large size and so I think these are going to be great if you are going to be running or if you are going to be moving very briskly through the city maybe in New York walking fast uh, these will have a very nice feel in your face and then when it comes to weight these are lightweight so they're not going to be weighing you down on your face or around the bridge of your nose or around your ears where some sunglasses that do have some tech inside of them do um, these are lightweight and I feel I can wear these for a long time without being uncomfortable and then when it comes to durability I do feel that these will hold up well now they aren't waterproof or water resistant so you do need to be careful with that but the lenses are scratch and shadow resistant so I think they'll be fine for working out especially going for a run in they can keep the sun out of your eyes but also to keep those jams pumping in your ears to keep you moving but just don't go swimming with these you don't want to do that all right, keeping things moving along, let's talk about setup. And since these are Bluetooth enabled, you can just go into the settings app of whatever device you're using and just pair these sunglasses to that device. But it is recommended to download the Bose Connect app onto your device. And now you can go through the setup process in that app and it can do a bunch of different things. So it'll allow you to be able to update your firmware, just like I had to do the first time uh, I paired these sunglasses to my phone. And also too, you can control the volume of whatever music you're listening to and you can get technical support and things like that just by looking at the manuals and stuff. But but yeah, either way will work just fine, but I do recommend using the app. And so once you get these set up, now you're ready to go ahead and start using these. Now, first, I'm going to just start off with the audio quality because coming from Bose, you expect some really good quality and they did not disappoint. These things sound really good and it's unique because these don't have anything that plug into your ears or anything like that. Uh, these are actually an open ear concept. So they have speakers built inside of the frames of these sunglasses and you're able to walk and still listen to things like your music, but still be aware of your environment. So this is incredibly useful, especially if you live in an urban environment where you're walking through intersections sections, you're crossing streets, you still want to be able to hear the traffic or hear people around you, but still enjoy your music. And this allows you to do that. And just overall from this particular type of open ear format, I have used this in other devices, but this is the best sounding one that I've used. So Bose did a good job on that. Now there is one concern with an open ear format and that is sound leakage. And I think Bose did a solid job with not having too much leakage. Now, if you're in a quiet environment like I am now, and I put the sunglasses on, I turn the volume up to max. Yes, people in the room will be able to hear the music playing out of them, but these are sunglasses. Glasses. So they're going to be mostly worn outside and you're going to have some type of noise, whether it's the wind, whether it's cars or other people walking by. Um, and I found that even if I had the volume all the way up, people really didn't notice. So if I did find myself using these maybe somewhere on the bus, I would probably have them around the medium range, which is still pretty loud and pretty clear. Um, but I find at that range, it'll be pretty hard for somebody to kind of hear what you're listening to. Now on the bottom of the right hand side of the frames, you will find one single button. And this button does have multiple use cases. So it's going to be used to be able to power on and off these sunglasses. But also too, if you are listening to music, you can control your playback by just pressing it one time to play or pause your music. And then you can double press and triple press to be able to skip or go back between your songs. And this button can be used to answer phone calls or activate whatever voice assistant that you're using on your phone because these sunglasses do have a built-in microphone inside of them. So, I mean, everything with this means that these sunglasses can allow you to be hands-free and so you can keep walking to whatever destination you're going to and you really don't have to interact with your phone, which is always a good thing. And so, yeah, that's everything that these Bose frames can do. They allow you to be hands-free, but also be able to listen to your music with really good sound quality. And these are just really techy sunglasses, but they don't look techy. I'm not really big into style, but you know, 
I look good in these, don't I? Leave a comment down below to let me know how good I look in these. But yeah, so anyway, um, I like these, so I'm going to be rocking these for a while. So if you're interested in picking these up, you can check them out on Bo's website. I'll leave a link down below. They're running $199.95. And the one big update that's going to be coming soon is going to be the Bose AR, which allows um, this to be able to work with different augmented reality functionalities inside of other third-party apps. So more information about that is going to be coming out soon. I'll make a follow-up video talking about that. But right now, I'm just going to wrap up this video, and I thank you for watching, and I'll catch you later. Peace.